we can start at 608 and nobody has joined in the last three, four minutes. Mm -hmm. Hi everyone, my name is Roshan. I'll be like the main presenter for this, um, these few meetings. There are gonna be other people um, listed as mentors, as you could see. They will be helping separately in breakout rooms. So if have you already received an invite to a breakout room? No, I've not yet sent, so I was thinking to oh, send. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, so he's going to send like invites to breakout rooms. If you get the invite, you don't need to accept it. It's only if you do need some help or you're like falling behind in a certain portion, you can go into the breakout room. There's going to be some mentor there to assist you. Um, so if you have some trouble in installation, you can go in the breakout room, share your screen. Um, just give like a heads up by like raising your hand or typing a message like in the chat just to like let the mentor know that they also need to be in the breakout room. So we will start by introducing ourselves. So just say your name, your grade, and what team you're on. So um, Mr. Um, vale Morgan, do you want to like call out the names so people can introduce themselves? I think first let's do the frog for student mentors. Let them introduce and then we can introduce the students. I think that would be a good idea. If mentors can go and introduce yourself. Maybe so they know what, how to say and all so you be, you guys begin so should we go in alphabetical order in the participant list i go like the mental list like go uh, yeah, written the screen right you can go with that list yeah we, yeah yeah so joshua could you start yeah so i'll go first hi my name is joshua huang um i'm right i'm a rising high school senior so this will be my fourth year on uh frog course um, I'm mentoring Team 6294, the SpaceX bots. So I'll be basically helping with that breakout room as well as three other students from uh, 11254. So, yeah. Hi, my name is Sanjit Urupa. I'm going to be in ninth grade. I've had three years of FCC experience and two years of FLL experience, all of them being programming experience. And I'm going to be helping out with Team 11254 in their breakout room. Hi, I'm uh, Sujin Kuruba. I've been doing FLL for four years and FTC for one year. This is my first year in FRC. I'm a ninth grader and I'll be helping out the remaining six students from 11254 and the seven students from 11244. Hi, my name is Animesh. Uh, I'm going to be a sophomore next year, and I'm going to be helping with Team 10477. Hi, I'm Uzair. Wait, you go first. I'm Sapasya. I'm going to be a freshman this year, and I'm going to be helping out Team 11129. Hi, my name is Vasir. I am currently mentoring and will be helping out Team 6134 Black Frog. And I am a sophomore. My name is Uver. I'll be helping out with Team 11244. Um, I'll be a senior next year and I have one year of FTC experience with programming. So should we go ahead to the students? I'm going to call out the names one by one. Okay. So yeah, I think I see Arush from 11254. Hello, my name's Arush. Uh, I've been doing uh, FLO for two years and I'm going to seventh grade and starting my first year of FTC. Okay, Adit. One one two four four. My name's Adit. My name's Adit, but I. Huh? My name's Adit. I'm on team one one two four four, and I've been in FLL for two years, and I'm going to sixth grade. Okay. 
Okay, next is Aditya, 6294. Hi, I'm Aditya from Team 629, going into 8th grade. Oh, yeah. Okay, next is Alice, uh, 11129. I'm Alice, I'm going into 8th grade, and I've done two years of FLL and one year of FTC. Okay, uh, Anik, 11254. I, my name is Anik, and I'm going into seventh grade. I did FD, FLL for two years, and I'm doing FTC. Okay, Anish Manda, 10477. Hi, my name is Anish. Uh, I'm going to eighth grade this year, and um, I'm on team 10477. And I've done one year of FLL and one year of FTC, so this will be my second year. Of FTC. Okay. Next, uh, Anshul, 11254. Hi, my name is Anshul. I'm in team 11254. I'm going to seventh grade. This is my second year in FTC, and I've done two years in FLO. Okay. Anushka, 11129. I'm Anushka. I did FLL for two years. This is my first year of FTC and I'm going to seventh grade. Okay. Next, Anvi from 11129. I'm Anvi. I did FLL for two years. I'm going into sixth grade and this is my first year of FTC. Okay. Deepchika. Hi, my name is Deepshika. I'm in team 11254. This is my first year of robotics and I'm going into eighth grade. Okay, Drew B6134. Drew, you're on mute. Okay, I will get back to Drew at the end. Uh, Divya, 11254. I am Divya, I'm in team 11254. I've been doing FLL for three years in FTC. Um, this is my second year of FTC and I'm going into eighth grade. Okay, uh, next Ishan and uh, Nirvan can introduce number one. Hi, my name is Ishan and I'm going to eighth grade. I did FLL for two years and this year will be my second year at FTC. Hi, my name is Nirvan. Um, I'm going to eighth grade this year and I did two years of FLL and this is my second year at FTC. Okay, okay. Ishan, you also connected separately? One more time or is another Ishan here? I'm different. Okay, yeah. Go ahead, Ishan. From My one. name is Ishan and I'm in, I'm going to seventh grade and I'm in team 11244. Okay, next is Ethan, 6134. I'm Ethan, I'm going to seventh grade. I've done two years of FLL and this is my first year in FTC. My team number is 6134. Okay, next to uh, Hassani, uh, 6134. Uh, hi, I'm Hassan Tigala. I'm going to seventh grade and I've done two years of FLL and this is my first year in FTC. Okay, next uh, Ishan said 6294. Hi, my name is Ishan. I'm on team 6294. I've done two years of FLL and this is my third year of FTC. I'm going to eighth grade. Okay, Gia 6134. My name is Gia. Uh, I did FLL for two years. This is my first year of FTC. Okay, Naveen V, uh, 11254. Hello, my name is Naveen, and I'm going to eighth grade. Uh, I've had two years of FLL experience, and this is the, my uh, first year in FTC. Okay, after Naveen. 
Pawan, uh, 11254. Hi, I'm Pawan. I'm from um, Team 11254. I'm going into 7th grade, and this is my first year of robotics. And then Raima, 11129. Um, my name is Raima. I've been doing, this is my second year of FTC, and I'm going into 7th grade. Okay, so next is Sanvi, 6134. Hi, I'm Sanvi. I'm going to 7th grade. I did three years of FLL, and this is my first year of FTC. Okay, next is Siddharth, 36294. Hi, I'm, Sid I'm Siddharth. And I've done FTC for one year and FLL for one year, and I'm going into eighth grade. Okay, next, uh, Simran. My name is Simran, and I'm going into eighth grade, and it's my third year of doing FTC. Okay, next, uh, Tanush, 11254. My name is Tanush. I'm from Team 11254. I'm going into seventh grade. I've done three years of FLM, FLL, and this is my first year of FTC. Okay, Wenhan, uh, 11244. Um, I'm Wenhan, and I'm going to seventh grade. I did two years of FLL and um, starting FTC. Okay. Okay, so Drew, uh, I see your message. Uh, you could not, um, you're having some issues. Do you want to try one more time? Hello? Yeah, I think we hear you. Uh, okay, uh, my name is Dirv Bahugana. I did uh, two years of FLL, and this is my second year of FTC. Okay, that's good. That's the last one. So uh, everyone introduced. Anu, I think, uh, should we do any other introduction or we should be good? I think we are good. Uh, well, you can introduce yourself and then I'll go ahead and introduce myself. Okay. Okay then. So hi everyone. Uh, my name is Vail. Um, I am uh, a parent mentor for programming team. And I was with my daughter in FLL uh, for three years and then FTC for two years. And now I'm um, moving into Frog Force. Hi everybody, my name is Anu Urpa and I'm also one of the parent mentors. Um, I basically do most of the, out, uh, the outreach stuff and all those things. Um, so, I, so I've done FLL, FTC and FRC, all three of them together. Roshan, it's all yours now. Yeah. All right. So just make sure that if you have any questions, um, you can attend the breakout room. Um, you'll be invited eventually, and you don't need to directly accept it unless you do have questions, and then just um, send a message in the chat to convey, or either raise your hand to convey that you're going to enter a breakout room so someone can enter in with you. So as far as um, this, session goes, we're just going to cover the installation and what you need for future sessions and also the, like the basic fundamentals to set the roots in for the FTC programming. So we'll be installing Android Studio um, as the integrated development environment, which is just um, like where you would write your code and deploy it to the phone. So we can start off if you haven't already. Um, going to the Android Studios website to install it. So just directly type it into Google and, or if you see the link developer.android.com slash studio, just go directly to that link and install it. I mean, download it and then we'll go over the installation process. And once you're done, just either type it in the chat or raise your hand so we know.
um, those of you who are raising your hand, do you have any questions? Since no one's talking right now, maybe now's a good time to ask them. So I'm assuming we can move on since most of you are done. So if you do have your hand up, you can just put it down. So in terms of downloading it, you would have to click the, the exe file if you have Windows or the corresponding file if you have a Mac. So just go ahead and say you agree to the terms and go ahead and click download. And once you're done, just raise your hand. When will the meeting end? So the meeting was intended to be from six to eight. If we do happen to finish before then, we will end before then. So that's just your rough estimate. Wait, uh, I have a question. Go ahead. Uh, in the past, uh, my team has used uh, another version of Android Studio. So do we need this or is it okay to just use that version? Yeah, it should be fine. Um, like I'm assuming you already have like some Android Studio 3.0 or greater, so that should be fine. Yeah. Are we only Just remember be calling today? Sorry, could you repeat that? Are we only going to be installing today? Yeah, so today's is going to be the main like setup and installation to make sure everyone's at the same place before we can move forward. Just remember, once you're done, just raise your hand. Yeah, I see still many hands not raised. Whoever is done, you can raise your hands. Okay, I think Arush wants to know how to raise hands. Aroshan, you want to explain that? Um, do you know how to go to the participant window? Yeah, user sent a message. Good, a lot of hands raised. It still looks like we're waiting on a couple people, so. Okay. Okay. So I think downloading taking time for some, some,
some of the teams. Hi, this is Sudeshna. Um, I had a question. Uh, is it uh, different for MacBook, the down installation? Yeah, I think when you yeah. download... Yeah, go ahead, Prashant. Yeah, you continue, sorry. No, no go ahead, Roshan. Sorry, you go ahead. <laughs> I mean, in terms of like the file, it won't be like an EXE, but in terms of setup, you'll basically have the like same steps going forward. Did that answer your question? This is Sudeshna. Is the uh, installation directions different for a MacBook? Um, I don't believe so, but Sanjit, a uh, MacBook user, could you better answer this question? So the installation should be there. So up to this point, it'll be a little bit different. But after this step, I believe, like after 2.0, two or 2.3, it'll be the exact same. So um, did you download a .dmg file from the website? So on Mac? Oh, uh, this is uh, uh, this is Panindra here, Sudeshna stat. So I basically downloaded the, um, the file which was sent through the email and uh, once uh, I clicked on install, I got a pop-up which says that, uh, you know, import Android Studio setting from, there are two radio buttons, configure installation folder, or there okay. is another radio button which says do not import settings. So you're um, a couple of steps ahead by now. So you can just wait until. Oh, okay. For some time. Okay, all right, thanks. No problem. So I'm going to continue on towards the next step. Everyone can put their hands down. So some of you may have seen a screen similar to this and you, some of you already clicked next. So um, this is just the basic Android Studio. So for basically the next few steps, you'll just keep clicking next. And then you'll see install, assume some may have already done it. So just, it's just a click through at that point. And then you wait. And then you may see an option to start Android Studio. Or if you have already installed Android Studio previously, you'll see um, like what 
they were referencing, which is like the pop-up. You can just click do not import settings. So we're all on a clean slate. Also, can I add something? Yeah. Can you go back a couple slides to the, um, the components? Which one? So one? by default, Android virtual device is selected. You want to deselect that because we won't use that for FTC. Can you go back to uh, uh, the previous steps? Uh, this one? No, the one before this. This one? Yeah. Uh, is that automatically uh, ticked and we have to untick it that do not create shortcuts? Oh, wait, it's not. I, sorry, sorry. Yeah, you know. I don't remember the default setting, but if you, it's basically optional. If you want a shortcut, you can click it. If you don't want a yeah, shortcut, yeah, no, you can no, click it. I didn't read that part. So sorry, sorry. Ignore the question. Uh, hey Roshan, uh, all the breakout rooms are ready, but I've not yet released them yet. Let me know when it is time to open them. Okay. Yeah. So if anyone has questions, then we'll just open up the breakout room so someone can assist you. Uh, did you just say that uh, to click do not import settings for a MacBook? It's the same for both Windows and MacBook, but yeah, it's, you don't have to import the settings. Just remember to raise your hand once you're done. Hello, this is Adit's dad, Pavan, and uh, could you guys go a couple slides back? And uh, there is a setting, I think one of the, one of the buttons uh, is virtual something, sorry, I forgot the name. Oh, the, yeah, the AVD, you don't need to check, so. I think, you know, by, unfortunately, like before we, we went to this and we, we selected that and we installed that. Do we need to reinstall? Uh, no, it's fine. It just takes up more space. I don't think it will negatively impact you. It's just more steps and like more space that it's going to take on your computer okay other than okay thank you then
it looks like we're still waiting about on half the people, so. So, so Roshan, um, is this, I thought you were a few steps ahead or this was the step you wanted them to stop at? Um, they should stop it where it says like start Android Studio. I just backed up since some people had questions on this slide. Okay. Yeah, you should be on something similar to this where it gives you the option to start it. Uh, for me, it says uh, choose the install type. What do you select for that? What are the options you see? Standard and custom. Oh, I think you're on like the customization settings, if I believe. Am I wrong? Uh, uh, I think so. I'm not sure. Maybe if you could go into a breakout room, someone could assist you there. Okay. Okay. Which uh, team uh, number? Can you please give me a team number or what's your name? Sorry, I didn't get My that. My name's Arush. Arush, team number? 11254. 11254. One, one, two, five, four, one second. Let me... For me, it says import. I'm opening up all rooms. Okay. So whoever needs only get into the room. Otherwise, others, please stay on this, uh, this room itself. Okay, I'm opening all rooms. Uh, yeah, and yeah. Before you go into the room, let uh, let somebody know so the student mentor uh, can go into. Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm adding student mentor uh, Sanjit and uh, Sujan to that. I, uh, yeah. It says to import Android Studio settings. Yeah. You can click do not import. Okay. Okay, uh, and I think the room should be opened. I see Sanjit and Srijan joined, I guess. Yeah. Okay, so they should have joined. Okay, good. Now let's continue this room, others. Yeah. So a few of you still haven't risen their hand. Are you still working towards completion? Okay. We only have four people who haven't downloaded it yet. So Ishan, Pavan, Siddharth, Simran, are you guys all, um, you guys, if you have any questions, play, uh, feel free to go to the breakout room and some your student mentor will help you. Just let us know if you're going there, that's it. So Deshna, I see that you have come back. If you're done, then raise your hands. Raise your hand. There was a question, uh, is 3.4.2 work? So does it work? Uh, that's a question from Alice. Uh, maybe uh, Roshan, you wanna answer that question? Does 3.4.2 work? Yeah, older version should be fine. Okay. It should be fine, Alice. Um, I think someone wrote in chat that uh, they uh, finished it, but it won't work to raise their hand. Okay, Simran. So 
Okay, I think we can move forward into installing FTC Skyscale. So you can search up the GitHub repository. I already sent the link via email to download. So if you've already downloaded that, just ignore the next couple of steps, I believe. So the first step is just to find the link to the GitHub repository. So you use Google to find it. Yeah, and could everyone lower their hands? I think you're right. So you should see a link similar to what I'm showing you right now once you click it. And then where you see releases like somewhat in the middle to right corner, not really corner, but it's on the side. Just go ahead and click that. So once you click it, you should see um, somewhere where it says assets and there should be a link where it says source code. I already sent this link out. So if you already downloaded it, just ignore the step. Well, I think Ishan and Nirvan of 10477 said that they have a question. If you download the master project, will it work? Um, yeah, I don't know. I think they're technically the, the same thing. It depends on how they modified the releases. Oh, also, one thing to know, if you're a Mac, uh, if you use a Mac and you're having trouble with the zip for some reason, it's probably because you need to use the uh, the tar.gz file. Um, yeah. For me, when I clicked on the link, it just went straight to a download. Yeah, yeah that's, that's what it's, that's supposed, what it's to do. supposed to do. Okay. It downloads a zip file or tar.gz. And also in my Android Studio thing, it's asking if I want to delete some directories. Wait, sorry, could you repeat that? It says the directories below contain configurations and system files to use versions of Android Studio. Check the box to each directory you want to you see. You want to go into a breakout room and discuss that? Okay. 6294. Uh, my Android Studio says this wizard will set up your development environment and so on. You're a few steps ahead. You, uh, you weren't supposed to launch Android Studio yet. Because it will start the installation, like the set, like the settings wizard. Yeah, we are not on the the step. We're just we just downloaded and installed Android Studio. We haven't yet opened it up. So if you already downloaded the zip, you could go ahead and extract it if you need to. If the zip already downloaded for you, you can just raise your hand. So. I think we can go to the next slide. So the next couple of slides are just extraction of the 
Um, you can pick any folder, it really doesn't matter, but we're just extracting the zip file. And then once it's extracted, you should see a separate folder containing it, such as this. Wait, once we extract it, uh, what do we do next? Um, after you're done extracting it, just wait. Okay. Can I get uh, like a hands up after everyone's done? If any of you are having issues and uh, if you think it might be easier, you might. Sudeshna, if you wanna, uh, she has a question, if somebody can answer it, but uh, you guys can answer that question or she can go to a breakout room. And then I think Amrit, Amrit, if you can rename yourself with your team name next to you, uh, next to your name. Which team are you from, Amrit? Okay, can you put your team number? Is it one one two five or two four four, Since you are late, it might be better if you go into a breakout room and work with one of the mentors. Okay, I'll assign you to your room. 
One. Robin said he needs to go to a breakout room. So. Okay. One, one, two, five, four. Okay, Tanush is in the one one two four four. I think Srijan joined. The break. Divya room. also said she needs to go to that room. Yeah, Amrit in the room. Uh, who is that? Was there? Yeah, is there? May uh, go to that breakout room. I think I'm at the one one two four four. Uh, yeah, you have to go. Amrit, Amrit is waiting there. Oh yeah. Okay. And Divya and Pavan can also go in and um, because we kind of share one one two five four. Is anyone waiting for me in my breakout room? Uh, no, nobody waiting in your room. Okay, cool. Do you want to split it? It's already split. I already split and assigned. Okay. Okay. Okay, six one three four. Uh, I think Vasu have to join there. Uh, Arya and Ethan waiting. Vasu from Frog Force. So those of you done could just go ahead and start Android Studio. Okay, Vasu joined there. That's good. Chia, you want to go into your breakout room so you can. So just, again, if anyone's waiting, just start Android Studio. Joshua and Animesh, you have, have trained your team very well, I think. Nobody's going to the breakout room. Um, no, after starting Android Studio, just wait there. Is there people still in breakout rooms or is everyone back? 32 participants here. I think we've had 38. So there looks like six people are in the breakout room. I can start. Checking, yeah, 11254. Um, they're in breakout room. There are one, five people there. And then 11244 also. Well, can we get two people from that 1124 and maybe put them in uh, one person in Animesh's room and one person in. Uh, Joshua's room. So in one one two four four only uh, one person uh, there. So I will go to the other one. Yeah. Yeah, Pawan, uh, Tanush. There are three people. Let me go to the room and yeah, uh, ask them. I'll move them. Okay. And uh, 
uh, Joshua can start, go to your breakout room. I will send them to your room. Okay. And Animesh you. too. Yeah, Animesh. Okay, I'll send one for you, Animesh. Okay. Thanks. Okay, so I'll go to that room. Uh, this is Sudeshna. Um, my folder is unzipped and all that, but uh, do I need to do any installations? Folder is unzipped, then um, open Android Studio and uh, then you'll be all caught up. Okay. Okay, Divya, one, one, two, three. Okay, I'll move you to Joshua's room. Uh, hi, this is Anshul. Um, my yeah. screen says, "Welcome." This wizard, the uh, this wizard will set up your development environment for Android Studio. Uh, am I on the right screen, or did I go uh, one step forward? Um, actually, you're on the same screen, but the modern one looks slightly different, so that's fine. Okay, thank you. Eventually, you should all like come to a screen like this. Uh, Divya, I moved you to another room. Can you join your breakout room? Joshua is waiting there. Uh, hi. Uh, we don't get the input. The next slide. All we get is uh, welcome. This wizard will set up the development environment, and it says next at the bottom. Do we need to press that so that we can get to this import project? Step. User, could you answer that? Yeah, so these slides are a little bit, uh, step five is a little outdated, so um, we might need to um, move away from the presentation. Um, I sent a picture in chat, does it look like that to you? Uh, Could you tell them what to do if it's on that step? Yeah, just click next. Okay. But okay. just to confirm, is that what it looks like? Or am, am I? I can, I can save else? my screen if you want. Uh, just for like two seconds so that you understand. Yeah, that's fine. So, share screen. Oh, you cannot share screen. Oh, somebody has to give me the. So. Which team are you on? Uh, maybe we can just get into a breakout room. It might be easier. Oh, okay. I mean, I can go, but just to share screen, because I'm sure everybody will be at this this point where it says, as soon as you start... I've seen a couple of questions on that, so maybe we can just share the screen. Okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure uh, that applies to everyone right now. So. Yeah, because everyone will be on this one, but the team is 11254, and I just want to show this once to... Are you able to share the screen now? Okay. I think you have to unshare. Uh, you have to stop sharing, Roshan. Yeah. Yeah, now I can. Hold on. So I'm going to... Yeah. Select a window. Yeah. Share. Yeah, can you see the screen now? Yes. So that that's the... Uh, that's what we get. So if we are on correct place... That's yeah, the... so I you can just click next through these steps. Okay. 
So, yeah, just to stay with standard. Yeah. Okay. And that this okay. is up to you, but it's just yeah, clicking yeah, next through. This all doesn't matter, right? So finish. I'm just checking everything. Yeah. So for some reason it installs the emulator. Yeah. So, sorry, Anu. I just wanted to make sure everybody gets this if they are stuck. Yeah, yeah, sure. No problem. Not a problem at all. I think the people that selected the ABD would have this issue. So that's probably why it's not in the presentation because it was supposed to be unselected, but it's fine. And it's just going to take a little longer. No, when I did it, I unselected ABD, but it still said something about the emulator. I don't know why. Selected ABD and um, yeah. So Can you move back a step? Oh, you want me to move? Uh, I don't know how to move back. It's just second. clicking basically next through the slides. I don't think there's any specific options you have to select. Do you? Yeah, I think this has no. to finish. Yeah, I think you just, the main thing is just click standard and then just scroll through the entire thing. So I can stop sharing so that people are not confused, but those who are in this stage, we can now guide them. I'll let this finish. I don't know what is this unzipping. Um, it's just, um, I believe, like a bunch of utilities that's used to build a oh, okay. project and such. Okay, okay. It's downloading the Android SDKs as well. Okay, so so far it's all going good, I think. Yep. So I'll unshare the screen so that you you can bring back. If I'm stuck, we can always do this. But I hope uh, those who witness this, if they get that screen, they can they can do what uh, you know Anu and Roshan guided us with. Let me unscreen share the screen. Hold on. Yep, I stopped sharing now. Uh, hi, this is Sudeshna Stad here. Uh, just have a question on the um, Skystone. The folders after getting uh, extracted, is there any steps which need to be done after that or that's the end of it? So after you unzip the file or extract the file, um, we're just waiting for everyone to get to the screen so then we can integrate both Android Studio and that project that we downloaded. Okay, so okay, fine. So I'm I'm also waiting for that one. I mean, on the screen, whatever you're showing now, I've come to that yeah. place. Okay, so this is right. the goal screen to be at, and then we'll progress from there. Just raise your hands once you're at the screen. Oh, okay. Uh, just for uh, everyone uh, information, I'm sure is on the screen successfully. Thank you.
Well, are there a few more kids and people in the breakout room? So I don't see raised hands for a few of you. Are you guys still waiting on it or? For, for me, it's saying that it's running some Intel HAXM installer and it's not loading. Um, yeah. That's this just like a, I think the best option is probably to attend the breakout room to share your screen so people can get a better idea on how to guide you. I'm on, I'm, I'm doing this on a different device. Just cancel it, says. Anu, uh, can you make me host? I'm for me when I switched the room, it did not reconnect. I just rejoined. It shows you as the host, well. Uh -huh. oh. I see two of your names, oh. so I think the host to you got left behind and knew you came in or something. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay, let me find. <laughs> I kind of switched between uh, room. Uh, Animesh was waiting for long. I thought I'll tell him, come back. <laughs> I, I'm already here. Yeah. Oh, yeah, okay. I'll, I'll make you the host, okay. There. Did you get it? Yeah, it looks like something I received, but um, it's hidden. Mm. Do you want to change the Okay. <laughs> okay, I got it now. Okay. No, thank you. Yeah. No so I think everybody is done. I see only three people. Divya, Ishan, and Ethan. And also Raima and Tapi, so they are also in the breakout room. Okay. And then I couldn't get past the sky zone. I just came from a break, breakout room, so I'm catching up. Okay. And Sanjit and Srijan also, they are in the breakout room. They can come back. I couldn't get past the sky zone thing. This is Ishan, right? I'm not in so, who is the one talking? Ethan? Ishan. Who is Ishan, okay, so were you able to download the, the Skystone file? Um, yes. So, I, and did you get your Android Studio to this step? Yeah. Yeah, so I think you're all set. So any, everyone like that sees the screen, could you just raise your hand so I know? So when you see this step, just do you see where the red circle is? If you could just go ahead and click import project. And then it might take you to a directory where you could select which folder it's in. And then you would have to navigate to the folder. So it's the one where you see the like the green Android logo. That's the one you want to select.
So, I, Tanush, are you all, um, are you caught up or are you still working? Mine is saying that I think not working. I need help uh, getting the Sky Storm thing into the Android Studio. Like last step. Okay. Oh, one, one, two, five, four. I think it might be easier to go into the uh, breakout room. Hasini and Ethan, are you guys all set? I'm not. You should, uh, uh, if you're stuck on something, then go all to your break. Set. Gia, if you're still having a uh, problem, you should go into the breakout room. I think some, uh, Divya wants you guys to go back a slide. Uh, Joshua or Animesh, can you help in the 11129? Who is available? Uh, Animesh, are you available? Yeah. Okay, I'll add you to uh, Robot Agents team. Can you help there? It looks like Tappy is looking for some input. I'm adding you there, okay? Yeah. Uh Anwanti, just just is three more minutes to yeah, upload for me. Well, was it Hasini? Yes. 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 Yeah. Yes. Oh. Okay. Now, yeah. If you need any help, just go into your uh, breakout room. Uh, Wasu will be there to help you. Okay. It's, we are waiting here for others anyway, so.
<laughs> no, he didn't die. Oh, yeah. Has everyone made it to the screen? If not, I would suggest going into a breakout room or something. So only three people I see with their hands raised, that's Divya and Ethan. Arya, are you having issues? In, uh, any of you having issues, please go into your breakout room so we can move to the next screen. Alice, are you all set? If oh, you are... It's still downloading for me. Okay, all right. What about Ethan? I'm done. You're done? Okay, then raise your hands. Are, are you having issues raising hands? Yeah, the participant okay. is crashing. Okay, that's fine. Um, so if you already got to that step, you could click OK, and then it's going to run a build. So just wait patiently to take probably maybe five minutes. I'm going to lower the hands of the others who already had the hands raised. So after I'm getting a security alert on my thing. Yeah, I got that same alert when I went through it. Just um, click allow. What is the file that we need to choose from Skystone? So you don't choose a particular file, you choose the entire folder. Okay, thanks.
I think Alice wants to be in a breakout room. Okay, Alice, so uh, you have your breakout room, right? Alice, which team member number? She's trip 11129. Is the Tapasya there already? Okay. Uh, yeah. Uh, tapasya is in, uh, yeah, Tapasya and Animesh are there. Alice, you can go there. If your Gradle build it already and you're on some screen similar to this, just give us uh, your hand raise. Uh, this is Sudesh Nasdaddy. I have a question again for MacBook. Um, I got a pop-up which opened uh, the Skystone uh, editor and it says uh, two processes running, but also there is a message which says install plugins or ignore extension. Should I choose ignore extension? I think the best option is probably a breakout room because it's kind of hard to completely understand the screen without seeing it. Okay. Um, yeah, 11254. Okay, 11254. Already Ishan, Joshua there. You can go there, I think. Uh, Okay, one, one, two, five, four. Uh, I'm sorry, there are two groups. Uh, what's the name again? I'm sorry, what's the name of the student? Sudeshna. Sudeshna. Okay, I think there is already Sanjit and Srujan there. And maybe they're all busy. Uh, Vasu, uh, Vasu, uh, are you available? Maybe I can add Sudeshna to 6134. Um, actually, Sanvi needs a bit of help because she's having an SDK issue and okay. I'm not quite sure on what to do. Okay, so Uzair, can you help for SDK? You're for muted, Uzair. Which breakout room is that in? Yeah, okay. You know, you, know uh, you stay, stay in your room. I will send, uh, uh, I'm sorry, the name. Sudeshna. 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 Okay, I'll, uh, you go to your breakout room. I'll send Sudeshna there. Sanji, who needs help with the SDK. Sanji, who needs help with the SDK. Okay, so this now I'm going to add you to a different room, okay? Okay. Yeah. Uzair will join there. Um, it was Sanji who needs help with the SDK. Well, so you're still in the main room. Yeah. Um, okay, do you want me to go to the breakout room? Yeah, that would be. Okay. Yeah, Sanvi also has to go there. He said Sanvi, right? Okay, they're both up there. Uh, Sudeshna, do you still need help? Um, no. No? Okay. No. Okay, I'll put it back to the other room. Um, actually, I needed help, but there's no one in the breakout room. Is it Sudeshna? I'm just sorry. I'm trying to confirm. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Uzair, can you go to your breakout room? One, 411244? One, yes. Yeah, 11244. Four. Sudeshna, I added you to that uh, team. Uh, you can go to your breakout room again one more time. Okay. So come there. Yeah, Uzair and Sudeshna go to that breakout room, I, which, I, which is assigned to you guys. 
Yeah, so Deshna, you can go back. Yeah. Can you please go back? If you're, what? Do you want me to go back a slide? Yeah, a few steps, please. This step? Yeah. I mean, after this, it should, if you click OK, I think it's just um, mostly just a build that you're waiting for. Yeah, I'm after that one. This one? This, I mean, this, that's the loading screen. If you see the tip window, just close that. And then it, it's going to run a bunch of like stuff down here. Um, I don't know if you can see my mouse, but. Yeah, I can. Okay. And then after that, it should say configured successfully. Do you see that or not? Uh, yeah, on your screen. I mean, on your screen too. You might need to click the build if you don't see it, the pop up on the bottom. Yeah, I see it. Does it say successful? Yeah. Then you're fine. Okay, thank you. Just make sure to give a thumbs, I mean, not a thumbs up, or your hand raise once you're done. Oh, um, Roshan, I just got back from a breakout session. So did we do anything after just importing the... Uh, no, uh, it's just a build. Just waiting for it to build and seeing if everyone's there. Oh, gosh. All right, well, I think... Yeah, Ishan, go ahead and join the breakout again. I think you had a build there. I think Naveen needs a breakout room. Uh, Naveen, which team? Uh, one second, let me check. Who I think there? with Sanjit. Okay, Sanjit. Everyone that raised their hand had a successful build, right? Yes. If not, then. Yes. So Naveen, uh, what kind of problem you have? Because already Sanjit and uh, Srujan helping Pawan and uh, Anshul and Anik. Naveen. Uh, uh, when I um, go to build, um, it says, um, four times that the um, like the license for package Android SDK build tools is not accepted. Okay, Naveen, I'm going to move you to 6134. Wasu, can you help there? Yep. Yeah. Okay, you, you go to your breakout room. I'll send uh, Naveen to that breakout room. 6134. Naveen, I'm going to send you to another room, okay? Okay. Yeah, now you can join your breakout room now. In. Vasu is already there. Okay, good.
Ruby, are you are you still waiting on something? Dhruv, Sanvi, Simran, Tanush, are you and Venhan, are you guys all set? Gia, yeah. yeah, I think it's fine if you don't get to the update screen. As long as it says um, configured successfully. Is this the last step? It's, I think there's one more step and then that's it for the Android Studio installation. Where will it say configured successfully? It says it down here. Do you see my mouse? You might need to click build. You see the build in the bottom left-ish corner. And then there's going to be like text. And then at the bottom, it should say configured successfully in a certain time. When I click build, nothing happens. Yeah. Um, do you see the build at the top? Then you can click build and then build project. Um, I... Alice, to answer your question, it should start automatically, but if it doesn't, you can manually click build and I believe it's build project if I recall correctly. Hi, this is uh, Sudesh Nas dad here. Um, I've encoded an error when, uh, you know, when I imported the file. Looks like uh, I need to import a specific file for Mac, but in the email which I had, there is no file which says, you know, um, there's a separate zip file for MacBook. It, uh, it's not it's not a separate file because the project inside the zip folder is consistent. Did you click like a specific file or did you select the entirety no, of the folder? I, I just imported the entire uh, I don't know, Skystone folder. Do I need to try give a try again? There's a Skystone folder inside the Skystone folder, if that makes sense. You have to click on the one inside and not like the outermost. Actually, I don't see a Skystone folder inside the Skystone uh, file. So after you click it, is it just directly a bunch of files you see? I'm just trying to open it again. Just to give me... Yeah, I just see a bunch of files which says doc, FTC, robot controller, Gradle, libs, and team code. So on Windows, this is how it looks, but the one with the, like the Android logo is what you should aim to click at, like where it says Skystone-5.4. Did you click that? No, I'm not getting that at all on Mac. I'm not like a Mac user, so maybe, maybe like Sanjit or something could help you, but I thought in terms of steps, it should be pretty similar since the past few years it has been. Okay. So you can, um, I think Sanjit is busy in the other uh, room right now. Mm -hmm. uh, if it turns out, we can always do it at the end or something too, if that's okay with you. Yeah, if, you know, if uh, Sanjit becomes free, then probably you can you know, yeah. let both of us into a break room. In yeah, so I think, do you want to see, uh, Tappy, do you want to see, it looks like you're out back to this call. You also use Mac, right? Um, yeah, well, um, could you repeat the question? I kind of didn't understand what was being asked. So I was unable to uh, install. I got an error message. Uh, looks like 
I may not have the right folders which I have downloaded. So if we can go to a breakout room where I can just share my screen and say to show what, what I need to. What I, I so are, are you trying to open the uh, Skystone uh, uh, project into Android Studio? That is where you're having problem? Yeah. Um, okay, I think Tap, you can help. Oh, yeah. Okay, so uh, which team? I'm sorry, I didn't get the name. One, one, I can... Sudeshna. Sudeshna, okay. I will move you to that room. Okay, I'll move you to the 11129. Tap, you can go. I'll send Sudeshna there. So, well, how many people are there in 6134? Gia wanted to go. Okay, 6134. Uh, there is Naveen and Mark, only two. Uh, there's Maybe Joshua, Joshua can help. Joshua. Oh, yeah. Is anyone having the problem with like the build failing? Um, she just said that she wants to go to a breakout room. So maybe oh, uh, I can't get the breakout room. I think you have to send it to me again. Oh, okay. Uh, no, okay. you're already in that room. Okay, Ms. Rudipa, do I just join the same breakout room? That I'm yeah. Talking? Okay. Uh, yeah, the one which you are assigned to, and then uh, Mr. Well will uh, assign uh, Gia to the, to your room. Okay, yeah, yeah, sure. Thank you. No yeah, uh, did you receive the invite? Uh, or No, I only see my group's one. No, you are going there in your room, Tappy. Yeah, you're there in your room. Yeah, oh, you have to be there. Yeah. Yeah, I'm sorry. Uh, I know whom should I send to Joshua's room? Uh, Gia. Gia, okay. Six one three four. Uh, okay, I got Gia. Okay, so, okay, Gia, you should be in the room. Can you join your room, the new room you are assigned you? Joshua, oh. be there. I, oh yeah, I can. Okay. Um, I just joined from a breakout room. What are we supposed to be doing right now? Are you at this step which is on the screen? Um, so it doesn't give me any prompt that says remind me tomorrow or anything. But um, I did build. It's fine if you don't get it. Just make sure that your Gradle has built successfully, which you yeah, can yeah, check yeah. by seeing the confirmation. Yeah, okay, then that's good. Well, it's a Skystone 5.4 successful. Is that the same one or? Yeah. Okay. So Ishan, if you're all set, just raise your hand. Uh, and then Anvi, Arya, and Dhruv. If you guys are done, or if you're having issues, you need to go to the breakout room. Okay, so Anushka. Do we have multiple people in any of the uh, breakout rooms? Uh, well, because there are only 29 participants here. Yeah, I'm checking. So 1129, only one. Uh, the one is one. Okay, I see Anik, Anshul, Sanjit, Rujan. There are four. 
Navin Vasu. So there are one to one, one to one. Maybe Uzair and Animesh can take one each. And... and there is already one to one, but maybe uh, there are two mentors and two students in the same room in one, one, two, four, four. But is there anyone else needs a breakout room? Tanush, Anushka, Anvi. Anvi is like, okay, she's raised her hands. So there are only two people left. Yeah, Anushka, you need any help? And then Drew, Tanush. Only Anushka, Drew, Sudeshna. Sudeshna, you're back here, so do you need any help? Are you done? Yeah, it worked fine. Okay, please uh, raise your hand there so that we know you're good. Okay. Good, okay. Anshul, Anushka, Drew. Um, I think for the people that are like currently just waiting, raising their hands, they could um, finish by clicking build and clean project just to make sure everything certainly does build correctly. Just a confirmation step. I'm going to go and put everybody's hand down. Okay. Can you go one slide early? We just joined this after the. I don't know the disabling the instant run or yeah. Th this was done. We didn't have any logo or update recommended. Sorry, I didn't really understand your question. No, they didn't get this pop up, but that's not that can happen. Yeah, that's fine. It depends, like, if some people that have, like, older Android Studios might get it, some people might not. It, it doesn't really matter as long as it, the overall build is successful. I don't have an option to clean project once I click build. Same here. Or just click build project. Do you see something similar to that? Well, I clicked build, and then it didn't have like any option to clean project. Is, is rebuild? Yeah, project that's one. That's fine. If as long as it builds successfully, I don't think you need to worry about it. And there are all of these like yellow signs next to the um. When I click build, there's all these yellow signs next to the words. Which yellow signs? Um, they're what like, they they're, they're just yellow triangles. They look like caution signs. Is there an error message next to them? Um, um, so it's like the yellow sign and then sky stone, um, 5.4 to successful at 8-14-20. Oh, are you seeing those in the build window at the bottom left? Yeah. Um, I'm not sure what that means. If maybe it's just successful, but it's, those errors mean something else. I don't know if that has anything to do with the build failing. Does anyone else know about that? And then I don't have an option to clean project. I'm gonna open up my Android Studio and share my screen so it's not just a picture and you can I can actually navigate to. I'm on a Mac. 
Um, is the is the play button in the sort of like top uh, right ish area of their screen? Is that is it a green play button or is it grayed out? Uh, what? Right, so, so like you know the the play button, um, the green or it should be green at this stage, but like the play button in the top sort of right corner of your screen. Is it green or is it grayed out? What does it look like? It looks like a triangle, like um, like a triangle yeah, that looks Roshan like this. Can, Roshan can show that on the image. Or Roshan, it, it's on the image, right? It's on the screen image. Yeah, it's on the screen. It's on the presentation right now. You can look at it. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. mine's grayed out. Okay, so your project hasn't actually synced with its build.gradle file. Um, so I don't know, do you want to, do we need her to join like a breakout room if I want to help her or do we, I don't know. Um, or um, I remember in the better? other team. Yeah. Who wants to go to breakout room? Uh, Anvi. Anvi, uh, your team, current team number. Okay, I'm sorry. Wait, for me, it, the thing is grayed out, but in the bottom hand, it says that the gradle sync finished. Yeah, same with me. I I saw the same error with the other Mac user team. Okay, wait. So I, I already had someone. It. I'm on yeah. Windows. Yeah, I already had someone who had the same problem. So, yeah, can someone? I kind of know how to fix it now. But like, I guess I can just make it communal. So, like, the way you fix it is you go to File and then you go like Sync Projects with. Gradle, I think there will be some option for that over there. And it'll basically rerun the sync. Then your sync should actually throw an error saying that um, you don't have like some, you don't have a certain Android SDK installed. But um, do you want to go to breakout room? That will be helpful. Uh, yeah. You. If you okay. want to send them to my breakout room. Okay. So you go to your breakout room and I'm sorry, I need the name one more time again so that I can send one by one. Anvi. Anvi, uh, okay. I also have the same error. Okay, Anvi, I will, okay, I'll add you to, one second, first I'll add Anvi. Uh, this is how my screen looks like, so does yours like not match up to this? Um, no, it doesn't. Yeah, I moved Anvi. My button is grayed out. I. I the button might be fine if it's grayed out. It might just be because it doesn't have like a direct target to deploy to. Um, sorry, Roshan, maybe uh, Joshua is already waiting there. Anvi, you can go there to your breakout room. Who's the other person wanted to go? Me. I'm sorry, I didn't hear that. Uh, uh, I need to go also. Okay, yeah, I didn't hear your name, please. Can you repeat? My name's Arush. Arush. Uh, okay. uh, I also need to go. My name is Sanvi. One second. Are the people with this? Are the people with this error only MacBook users, or are there also Windows people? I, I, I'm error? on Windows. I'm also on Windows. Oh, okay. I have Arush, you join your room. You join your room. You're already in your uh, room. Uh, Anvi okay. is there. Joshua is there. Can you go to that room? Okay. Who's the third person had the same issue? Uh, Sanvi. Sanvi, uh, you are in which team number? Four. Okay, I got you. Okay, I'll assign you to another room. You go there, okay? All of you have I, the same I problem. have the same error. <laughs> okay. uh, if they have the same problem, should we assign them to like one room to see what works for yeah, one person? That's what I'm doing. That's what I'm doing. Okay, okay. Okay, I'm already sending them to who's the last person who said has the same uh, problem? Siddharth. Siddharth, uh, where are you currently? Siddharth, your team number? 629, wait. Okay, so you are in the correct group, same group. You have to join the breakout room. Joshua, um, in the room. This is Anshul. I also have the same problem. Okay, Anshul, uh, 11254, right? Yes, that's right. I'm, I'm sending you to uh, the room where Joshua is there. Okay, you have the same problem. Okay. Join your breakout room. Whoever had the problem, whoever mentioned your name, I put the same room where Joshua is there. You go and join the breakout room.
Um, we didn't get it yet. No, you won't get it. You just join the breakout room. It's the same uh, room. Uh, how do you get there? We had an uh, invitation oh, yeah. outside. Oh, thank you. Never mind. Um, out of curiosity, did anyone else have um, an issue with accepting licenses? I did. Mm -hmm. Okay. Me too. So I'm just trying to see. Okay. Um, so I was wondering, because I saw that, and um, what normally when it comes to accepting licenses, you, you, did you click accept on like every, on the things that I told you to accept? And did you follow along with each thing that uh, you were supposed to follow along with? Because I was wondering about that error. Is it the Android SDK licenses? Yeah, it's the Android SDK licenses. Twenty-eight. Were you able to something. figure that figure that out? Uh, no, I assumed that because they didn't accept the licenses, that they had to uh, redo it again to um, uh, ex reaccept it. Let me just check one way to do it before I tell everyone. Because I searched it up, I searched it up, and they said to check each SDK and make sure that it was accepted. So. All the settings lined up, so. Uh, I see some people on the breakout room. All others on this room, are we all on this screen? Uh, Ero Roshan is showing now. Uh, have you all reached this? Yeah. Yes. Okay. If anyone has not reached, uh, please l let me know so that we can get help. Okay. So I think 11129 is nobody there. And then 6294, there are four people. And then Anik. I think you should come back, I guess. Uh, Sanjit, any issue is solved? I think he was in your room. Yes. Um, okay. Okay. I think anyone that... else needs to go to our room. Okay. Uh, we'll wait for him to come back. 
Okay, so there is only one room. The, they are looking at these build issues. If you guys are all set, raise your hands so we know if anybody has any issues. Just if you are all done, just raise your hands. And Roshan, we were a few screens ahead of this screen, right? Went we little. This no, after where... this, it's just Tappy talking about the the rev. Okay, are like we after all... this, we're just—it's basically just seeing if it builds successfully. Okay, so it's built successfully for most of the people. Okay, we're waiting on still some more. Yeah, I think there are only uh, three three uh, three students who have issues on the build. I think everybody else back to this room. Yeah. So Aditya, okay. Anish Manda and everybody is good. Okay, Anushka, you good? Anush, no, I I need to. I have an issue. Kind of, can I share my screen or? Um, I think you, if you go to your breakout room, might be easier. You wanna uh -huh. do it then? Okay. Who is that? I'm sorry, I didn't get the name. She's 1129, so Tapasya has to go. Okay. Uh, Tapasya, Anushka, can you go to your breakout room? Okay. And Aditya, are you good? Uh, you are not in your room. I, I'll assign you to your room. No, 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 you, you are good. So are you good with the, uh, are you... Uh, good with this build state. I mean, are you in the right step? Well, um, so I had Android Studio from last year, and like it's showing me like last year's uh code. So I just wanted to see a way if I could just clear that um and get to like a new project. So that's why I want to break out room. Yeah, six okay. two nine four. Right you could just click file, close project, and then the step should basically be similar to what I showed. Yeah. Divya, Dhruv, Jia, are you guys still working? Okay. Naveen. And Venhan. Uh, which breakout rooms still have people in them? Yeah, one 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 two nine. I mean, they just went Tapasya and Anushka, and then Joshua, Sanvi, and An Sanvi and Anvi. They are in one room. Is there any other room? Yeah, Anik is in the room. I will move him to. No, I cannot move him out of that room. So he has to come back. Uh, who else? I think that's it. There are two two breakout rooms, and uh, I think uh, Anik and Srijan has to come back. So Ethan was saying, "When when is this over?" Because Zoom is requesting me to leave. Um, Mrs. Udupa, do you know why I would say that? Um, this shouldn't. Did we make it only six to eight? Oh yeah, because it was eight till eight fifteen. Um, so I think we'll have to leave by eight fifteen. So should we just invite everyone back and then um, have Tappy like present on her two slides? Seven minutes are there. Um, so who all are having issues now? Uh, the one in the breakout room and I guess everybody else is all set, right? So is, if it's just Tappy's slide, we should be able Joshua to Joshua said he's sending them back. Are they done? No. Okay, then. Yeah, I believe so. So let's just wind up quickly, I think, right? Seven minutes. Yeah. And uh, one thing, um, is everyone back? Almost everyone is back. Yes. I know most of you joined on time, but if we could just be 
more careful about time from next time because with the Zoom, with the time limit and all those things, it becomes a little difficult to go beyond the time what we have. So we'll appreciate if you guys all join in time so we don't have to repeat instructions. So I'm sending, asking Tappy to come back so we can finish the presentation. Yeah. And if somebody has some issues, we can, they can always contact us and the mentors, student mentors and So is Anik there still uh, in the breakout room? They're still in the breakout room, but we talked, like we finished their issue and then we said, you can go back and they said, okay. And then <laughs> they still haven't left. Yeah, I still see Anik in the room. Uh, I'm trying to move to, I'm not able to move. We went back in a couple of times, but they haven't, they like, they didn't talk to me once and so. Maybe you can go back, Sanjit, and tell, show him, does he know how to come back? No, like we said, you can press the blue button and they, have, they didn't like respond. They said nothing. Okay, should I send a message to all and then uh, should I close all the rooms? Uh, no, maybe because we are... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I'll send a message to all. Uh... Broadcast message to all. We are closing breakout room. Five minutes of the meeting left. I think we should just close it like right now. So um, she has time to present the last two slides. Yeah, I'm yeah. broadcasting and then I'm closing. Okay, all breakout room will close in 57 seconds. Okay, looks like it, it closes after a minute. Okay, is Tapase, you're back to this main yeah. call? Okay. Can you do the presentation on the next two slides? Yeah. Okay. So for all of you who didn't know, FIRST has released a new control hub. And so this control hub is actually pretty similar to this uh, expansion hub that we've been using for a couple of years. They're the same motor and servo and sensor input output ports. So like same number of motor ports, like four DC motor ports and six servo ports. The main difference really is that there is no port for the phone now. And this is one of the major changes that comes with this hub. The control hub takes the functionality of all the expansion hub and the phone, and it just like puts it together to combine it into one device. And this is actually a really great advantage because this can now take a smaller space on your robot and you can kind of put it down underneath all your cables and stuff so you have more room for your camera because most teams who use their phone as a camera, you obviously won't be able to do that now because there is no camera. But with this new Rev, Rev Hub, there are many other USB ports that you can plug in a camera with, which gives you more flexibility, um, if that made sense. I kind of went through that really fast. and. To configure your robot, the configuration process is still the same because they're the same motor ports and servo ports. So um, when I had to configure the new rev, I just used the exact same configuration that I used for my expansion hub. And to download your code, it'll look a little bit different because you don't have your phone to download it with. You can either download it manually onto the rev hub using a cable or I think you can like connect your laptop to the Rev Hub using Wi-Fi and then just download your code wirelessly. And just one quick thing to know about the Rev Hub is that you have to set it up in a way. You have to set it up so it can connect to your other phone that will be at the driver's station. And there's kind of like a long process-ish. It just takes like a lot of time, but it's pretty simple. So I put a YouTube video that is actually from the actual Rev site, and that's useful if you have the new Rev Hub and you don't know how to set it up. And yeah. And just to show you like a picture comparison, 
This is the old expansion hub and it only had this mini USB port where you could like connect your phone. And then this is the new rev hub where you can see that there are a lot more ports. There are more USB ports where you can connect your, um, like a camera or a webcam and then a USB-C port where you can connect your laptop into the Rev Hub and then some more ports over there. Yeah. Any questions about it? Do we have to get the new hub? Um, no, you don't have to get the new hub. The old hub works just as fine. This is just if you would like, like to because first has released this. Anything else? I think our meeting might be ending in one minute. Roshan, or in, if you have any closing comments, go ahead with it. And yeah. thanks, Tapasya. Mm -hmm. So thank you everyone for attending this uh, meeting. Hopefully we were able to solve most of your setup problems. If not, you can always contact us by email. Um, so any questions, if you have them, just try to ask them right now in like the minute you have left. Other than that, thank you all for attending and I hope to see you next week. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. Bye. Thank you. Thanks a lot. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Bye.